Not sure. I haven't seen him um, 29 months mm -hmm. on the 5th of April. Yeah. Um, and uh, she hasn't had cubs since then. She still looks after him. <laughs> yeah, leopards extremely clean cats. Mm. Yeah. Okay, can everybody see nicely like that? She gets her name, she uh from our lodge, okay. She's uh, been in this area for a long time now. She's our oldest female leopard. She is blind in one eye. Um, I'm gonna sneak forward a bit for us. Right, in parlor, there's some more. Oh, we call these guys the cockroach of the bush <laughs> uh, For our big predators. Mm. Another one over here. Two. Oh, don't stand up. <laughs> Is it normally? Is it normally um, that they go around in packs of two? Or? No, no, no. The young males will stick together. Okay. Yeah. Males hold territories, so a male will set up a territory, um, and young males and females move between the territories. Um, so white rhinos are social. It's one of the differences between black and white rhinos. Mm -hmm. Often see uh, two or three, sometimes more, white rhino together. Um, Black rhino usually by themselves, solitary. An extremely good sense of smell, an extremely good sense of hearing. You can see the big ears always moving. Heading south, I'm trying to south, I'm not going See now. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, Ryan, are the, are the 
another two rhino male and female? Two males. Two young males. Yeah, Nice herd. Big herd. Look this for female's tusk. Yeah, watching the road. Going. So he's going. Beautiful animal. Now these are the guys with the biggest sexual dimorphism of any antelope. Uh, the females are very light tan color, uh, short hair. You can see this guy dark chocolate brown uh, with long, long hair. Is he okay? Yeah, So we have the tallest lamb mammal in the world. Um, same amount of vertebra in the neck as us. Only seven vertebra in the neck. <laughs> the water hole yesterday. Oh, okay. I wonder where the rest yeah, of the yeah. group is. Oh, they're causing havoc in the tree, aren't they? Mm. And there's some more further on. Let's see that one. <laughs> I mean, he's trying to find a branch, but see, there's nothing out there. I'm not sure what it's. Uh... Got your flashlight. No, it's because it's so close. Uh, yeah, it's not. Doesn't it? Doesn't know what it's focusing on either, is it? No. Yeah. So even a little guy like that, if you were to zap you on your finger or even on your ankle, you'd probably, or you'll have serious complications on your ankle, but yeah, you'll probably still end up losing your finger. Okay, it just deteriorates all the tissue and rot your finger. <laughs> 